Hello again, friends, and welcome back to Bandle Tale, a League of Legends story. We are making progress over here. We have been through a portal. We're here in Bandle City, and we are looking for the three Ps today. We got some people we need to find. We have a post box we need to find. And we have some powder we need to find in order to repair the flask that we need to progress. So let's get going on those goals. Okay, so the first thing I think we need to do is try, um, what's up here? Have we been up here yet? I can't remember everywhere we've been yet. Uh, we're looking for a post box, which kind of looks like a little tree stump because uh, someone gave us a new carpet, but our pockets were full, so it went into the post box. So we gotta find a way to get that back. What is this situation? Nothing going on there at the moment. Let's see, have we been across here? Oh, this is one of our broken bridges, I believe. And we can't get through to that part either. There's somebody over there. Okay, we have to meet the gunners. We're looking for Bjorn. So we haven't found that person yet. Um, but I think maybe I might have just seen where we need to go. Across this bridge, here we go. Is this the way to the Bandel Gunners? Uh, we're looking for the gunners because they might have, um, yep, I'm one of them. They might have Ozzy's portal yarn. Oh great, you know Ozzy, right? Ozzy makes the best parties. Ozzy is my favorite. The burning lights he makes in the sky are awesome. Great, I love fireworks too. I'm actually trying to get Ozzy back, but I need some help. Do you know where he might store portal yarn? Sure do. Ozzy keeps all his stuff in our chest. Great. Could you check if it's... Uh-oh. Bjorn, what's going on here? <laughs> I'm talking to Ozzy's friend. I think she's my friend, too. <laughs> Bjorn, you can't have friends under martial law. Oh, boy. Martial law. Okay. So what do you call new friends under martial law? A security risk. Sorry. Ozzy's security risk. I guess we can't let anyone in or out. Even just for a little bit? But Mafi, what if Timo likes her? Who's Timo? Timo, he's only the greatest Bandal Scout to ever join our special forces. So great. When I grow up, I want to be just like him. Since declaring martial law was Timo's idea, a direct pass from him would work. But other than that, no way. So where can I find Timo? Can we share our intel about Timo, Bjorn? But that's a secret, Bjorn. Oh, he's talking to himself. But we both like burning lights in the sky. Okay, I can tell you what I know. Great, where is he? No idea. <laughs> okay, well that's helpful. Oh. Probably maybe try Green Sprout Grove. Okay, I don't know if we've been there yet. We'll look for it. Well, thanks. Uh, so what do gunners do? Gunners protect Bandle City. Wait, is someone attacking it? Are we in danger? No danger, because gunners protect Vandal City. Yeah, but like, from who? Hmm, can I say? Okay, okay, never mind. <laughs> do you like being a gunner? Sure do. But I can't leave the post, even when there's something I really want. Is there something you really want? A snack would be nice. Oh, I can get one for you. Really? Sure, hang tight. I'll bring it over. Uh, bring Glow Nana to Bjorn. Okay, well, we already have 11 Glow Nanas in our pocket, so let's go ahead and give him some. Here's your sweet delivery. Thanks, now I can share with the gunners. Boy, it'll make them happy. You helped me. Can I help you back? Can you please tell me what's in Ozzy's chest? Well, it's secret information, and there's a Martian law. <laughs> Bjorn, this is really important. I wouldn't ask otherwise. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Sorry, but the chest is very locked. Thanks, anyway. No, I promised to help. This burning lights box is good for a party, right? Thanks, yes, these will definitely come in handy. You're welcome. Okay, so wait, did he just give us something? Uh, we just unlocked his festival card, so we can invite him to festivals now. And it looks like he might have given us some firework. That's cool. 
Um, so now yeah, we're still working on repairing the flask workbench, and that's what we need the powder for, but we haven't figured out how to get the powder, but I had an idea on that. And we need to attach the vending carpet using the outdoor building. So that vending carpet is what we're looking for in the post box, but I wanted to bring this back out. And check out this grinding machine, because I was thinking after the last episode, like, we just put in a grinding machine. That seems like it would make powder, like crystal dust. <laughs> we have lots of crystals, so let's go ahead and uh, make some crystal dust and see if that's the dust that we need. Well, we need two kinds of dust to fix the flask. And the other kind is from that wall, but we have to get that multi-tool. Let's see if we did it yet. I can't remember. Um, we have to find... Whoops, we have to... <laughs> Hello. It's a little hard to control this character sometimes. Okay. We have to find that crumbling wall again. I think it was right up here. Um, oh, we can grab some more parchment. I guess it never hurts to have more. It, I guess it grows back, apparently. <laughs> okay. We're not going to grab too much. I need a dust scooper multi-tool. Okay, so that's the other thing that we're trying to build. Do we see a post box around here anywhere? Here's a place to catch fireflies. You know what, let's go ahead and set a trap because it won't hurt to have them um, if we need them because we do use our little glow pods every time we uh, do a food stand. So we want to make sure that we're getting more. And I think, did we build a firefly hutch inside our house? Or try to, <laughs> maybe? Um, okay, so the flask is down. We're looking for the post box. I don't see it anywhere yet. I think it looks like a tree stump. A pretty specific tree stump. So let's go see if it's down here. Ooh, we'll grab some more of this vital droplets while we're here. And we really should start carrying our backpack around with us. Because now we've left it. <laughs> we've left it where we were. We could have sat it down right there. Uh, we're keeping an eye on our orbs too. Uh, so that when they get full we can... I feel like we're going to need to do something there at some point. But we can't do it yet. Um, we're going to need... Oh, here's some more fireflies. We're going to need to empty those orbs pretty soon. I don't see the post box anywhere. Maybe we should check up by the portal. Do we think that it would be up there? Whoops. It's hard for me to get around that curve. <laughs> this, this character control is a little unruly, I tell ya. Okay, let's get up here. Um, how did we get to the portal. This way? This way? All the way up here? Alright, this is the portal and I don't see a post box here. We don't have it attached to our house, do we? Maybe it's in the uh, market square, so let's go back there. That's where our house is anyway. We need to probably pick it up. I wonder if we should go ahead and try to go through some of these other little portals. How much portal yarn do we have? Because we don't want to waste it either. We have 37 and it cost us 10 to go through the last portal. So right now we have three portals worth um, as far as we know. Okay, our dust is still working here. Do we see a post box anywhere? Did we go up here already? Oh, we haven't looked at this portal yet. It says go. Does this take you... Okay, you know what? Let's just try this out. We're going to set our one more firefly trap that we have. We're just going to try this out because maybe this zaps you to another place. Ah, yes. We can fast travel to the university and this one is locked. Because we haven't looked at it yet, maybe? So we need to make sure we look at that one next time we're down there. Okay, well that's good to know. That um, That's kind of like a little fast travel around the island kind of thing. Um, there's like a little control box here. Hmm. But this bridge is broken. Okay, there's nothing we can do over here. And I don't know where to look for this post box. Unless I'm just totally missing it somewhere. Let's see. It's not down here. 
Uh, we can't get through to the gunners. <laughs> Our, oh, you know what? We can take what powder there is. And let's go ahead and uh, run down here and see... Whoops. If this is, in fact, the powder that we need for fixing the flask. Um, wherever the flask may be. Here it is. Okay, that is the right powder. So we have one. And I know the other one is going to be the powder that's in that wall. So we got to go... Um, yeah, we got to figure out how to get that multi-tool. All right, let's go back to our... Sorry, guys. It's a lot of back and forth, but we're learning. <laughs> we're, we're learning and learning. Oops. Get across that bridge. There you go. And one of the things I'm learning is that I should probably take my backpack with me when we walk around. Okay, so if this is our... Let's go to this crafting table. Do, 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 do... We can make a crusher workbench. Do we want to make one of those? Um, I'm not really sure. Or is that what we already made? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's what we already made. Okay. So the dust scooper multi-tool is not, is not on that list. But maybe we have to make it at a different... Some of the things are made at different tables. Okay, but first, <laughs> we're going to check our skill tree and make sure we even have it unlocked. Okay, home upgrade we unlocked. Knitter Festival, Flower Pot. Big home upgrade. We have 32 orbs right now. Um, let's see here. Okay, repair multi-tool. This is where we're talking. Dust scooper multi-tool. So we turned it on. Oh, do we maybe need an assembly bench to make it? Let's spend 10 on the assembly bench and see if that's what we need. We can build one here on our little, um, oh, we need a blueprint and some kind of metal. Okay, this gets more complicated, but look, that is going to be what we need to make those tools, I think, because under new crafts, it shows, whoops. Where'd it go? It shows a bunch of the little multi-tools there. And like a battery and some different potions and traps maybe. Interesting. Oh, there's a spider web. Okay, so this is definitely what we need to work on. We need to figure out how to get some metal and a blueprint. Okay. <laughs> there's a lot of things to keep track of. We're still looking for that post box too. Let's check again what these people were selling in their shops. All right, we have some clay, we have some salt, we have junk. So, wait, can we go back to the Yarnville? Can we go back through that portal anytime we want to Yarnville? We need to go, where was that? This thing. Yeah, let's go in here for a minute and see if we can do anything in here. Okay, grab this junk while we're right here. We might as well. It never hurts to have more. Um, since that is how we make our wood and stone. And But I'm wondering if we... Oh, we have some here to collect. Uh, if we can also make like that metal here. Junk upcycler. Two. But we gotta have that dust from the wall. Okay. <laughs> This is, this is getting complicated. All right, so we'll go ahead and... Did we put a junk upcycler on our... Huh. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> we're going to make 10 of these here. We'll just go ahead and do this here. Some of them. Okay, but that's not where we can make metal. We can't go in there. I can't do anything with this now. Okay, so that might lead to something later then. All right, let's keep looking. We got to find that post box. I know there's one in Yarnville, so that's what I'm wondering. But I feel like there should be one here. We we just have to find it. Um, we still have to find Vigar too. We haven't found him yet. Let's go check his house again. 
Uh, he was down in here somewhere. Okay, let's see if he's at home now. Doesn't seem like it. We'll go ahead and grab some more crystals while we're here. Now that we know, we can make the dust with them. And there weren't any... We got everything out of there. Okay, so maybe nothing else we can... Ooh, there's a portal back there. wonder how you get to use that one. Interesting. Okay, moving on. Where would Vigar be? Do we think he went back to Yarnville? Ooh, what's this? More powder. We'll gather everything we can. <laughs> Oh, our orbs are full too. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go take a nap, go back um, to our, and see if we can go back to Yarnville for a minute and find something there. Because we don't seem to be making any progress here at the moment. We did get to talk to the gunners. Um, and we have to find somebody else now, Timo? We have to find Timo. Okay, that gives us some more of that. Um, let's put some thread on to start working. I'm guessing that all of this stuff just... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, we can make the dust scooper multi-tool. Okay, we needed the basic workbench. I don't know why that didn't work on the one outside. All right, well, we can make that now, so let's make it. <laughs> okay, well, that's some progress. Yay. All right, we have a dust scooper multi-tool now. Let's go into our pocket and make sure that it's equipped. We want to equip it. Okay, so it switches out the one that we had in our pocket. I thought it was going to be like attachments. Or maybe that just unlocks so we can be carrying more than one at a time. We haven't unlocked any of that, so we'll find out. Okay, let's go back to that wall then. We still have to find a post box though. I don't know if we have to go back to Yarnville for that or if it's around here somewhere and I'm just not seeing it. We'll keep looking. All right, let's go back to that wall though. Um, it was up here. Maybe it's in the square, but we checked the square. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, now we can gather this dust and fix the flask. Hooray, progress. <laughs> uh, we're going to go ahead and gather more than we need. Because why not? Um, okay, so let's run down here. It's down here. Um, right over here. And we should be able to repair this now. Sweet. I need a repair multi-tool. <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, so we have the supplies. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We have a repair multi-tool. It's the other one that was in our pocket. We just have to switch which one's in our, in our uh, hand. Okay, here we go. Now we got it. Okay. Flask repaired. Um, let's see what it says under that now. Star student. Craft a levitation potion in the flask workbench times three. Okay. We also have the stuff to do that. We're going to need a little bit more um, wall dust. We can make two right now. We'll have to go gather a little more wall dust. And then we can make a third one. Um, oh, I keep forgetting which button it is to run. Uh, this way, this way, this way, this way. <laughs> We're learning our way around. Okay. Oh, we got a firefly. Let's grab that. Uh, wait, we passed it. Where'd it go? Oh, well, I ran right by it. Okay. We need some more. Oh, we got to switch tools. Okay, yeah, this is definitely going to be helpful if we can... Um, carry more than one tool at a time or something. Not enough space in my inventory. Oh no. What? What's in our inventory? Oh, we need to put Ozzy's poster in our, and the fireworks. Okay, let's go put some stuff in storage. Okay, lots of running back and forth right now. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> We're making progress, but we keep finding out we need to do more. 
keep moving forward. All right, we, we got this. Easy steps, they just take time. So, all right, let's go into our greenhouse pocket for a minute. And did we build a firefly hutch in here? Let's see if we can build a firefly hutch. Yeah, we got the stuff. Um, we'll just put, we'll put it right here. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and build another one. And we'll put it over across from that one. Because we do have three firefly traps out right now. Um, so let's get these built. And then we can put the firefly that we have in our pocket in there. Um, what else is in our pocket right now? We have beet seeds. Yes, we do. All right, let's go ahead and take the beet seeds. We'll grab these beets, plant some more. Um, do we have enough to build some more? I guess we don't have enough to build some more little plots to uh, plant those right now. Okay, did, um, we need to put some there, okay. So that got a little bit of stuff out of our pockets. What else can we do? Oh, we do have a bug hutch in here. It's already got a firefly in it though. Okay, we just need the um, the little food for them, which I don't know how we make that. How do we, whoops, cancel that. How do we make the food for the fireflies? That's not there. Do, do. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know where it is. I don't remember. All right, we're gonna wait on that. Right now, we just need, whoops. Um, let's open this up and get our chest open. We have a little bit more room in there. Let's put this party poster. We probably won't need that with us. We'll keep the fireworks in there and put the rest of this junk over. Um, what about the black sand? I feel like we're using a lot of the crafting materials right now, so I don't want to put them too far. Let's put the beet seeds over. We have one more firefly trap. Did I just make that on accident or something? I thought we used all of our firefly traps. Okay, let's just pick this up for the moment. And... Okay, what were we doing? <laughs> now we have a little bit of pocket space. We need to go get some more wall dust so we can finish uh, making our levitation potions. And the wall dust is over here. It's a process. All right. Let's gather. Gather. We'll again get more than we need. Um, okay, and then let's run back down here. Was it here? No. It's all the way down. There we go. One more levitation potion. Done. Clean up the big rock from Bandel University. Okay, where is that? Is that this? Remove big rock. Nice. Oh, it just makes them float away. Okay. Now what's the big idea here? Oh, it's a philosopher's stone. Um, you talk? Oh, I've got things to say, all right. This potion of yours might have worked on simple rocks, but such shoddy measures won't rid you of the philosopher's stone. Okay. <laughs> I mean me. I was talking in third person. Can I somehow convince you to leave the market? I really need to clear it for something. Maybe you can, but only if I don't go too far away. I spend my time pondering life, the universe, and the lithification of sediments. Okay. <laughs> and this place is really good for thinking. Okay, I'll try to find a way to tie you down here. Oh, we need a way to tie them down. So what's the plan? Honestly, no idea. I've never helped a talking stone. <laughs> You're still surprised by talking inanimate objects? I'm sensitive, okay? How about a rope? Huh? Just tie the rocks down so they won't fly away into infinity. Then you can move them anywhere. Like to a rock garden or something. 
Talking is one thing, but I'll never get used to inanimate objects being this smart. Oh, stop it, you. That's problem solving 101. Okay, so now... Bring a rope and a cloth to the Philosopher's Stone. Skill required cloth making. Have we not unlocked that one? Let's check our skill tree. Cloth making. Would that be under knitting? There it is. Cloth making. Unlock it. Okay. Um, so now we just have to... Okay, you know what? We can put our house down right here. And roll this out. I don't know what these little question markers do. We have actually a piece of cloth in our storage, so we'll grab that. And then we need to craft a rope. Let's see where we can do that. A chill zone? Okay. Um, is rope under here? Oh, we can make a loom now. We gotta find how to get that metal though. All right, I don't see the rope on this one. Let's check this one. Nope. Um, oh, the rest of our crystal dust is ready. We'll take that. Can we craft rope here? No. Can we craft rope over here? There's so many different benches. There we go. Let's make some rope. Um, and we'll go ahead and craft a few, just so we have them. That'll get the thread out of our pocket. We have more thread waiting there in our little knitting machine, so we don't have to uh, worry about that. How many of these can we make right now? Okay, we made eight and we have our cloth, so let's go um, just pick this up. We're just going to pick it up. We're going to get in the habit of picking it up and taking it with us. Okay, let's talk to the Philosopher's Stone again. Tie down the rock. This place seems decent. Okay, so we've moved them. I uh, hope you'll have lots of great thoughts here. All right. Oh, we've finished passing our admission exam, unlocked the science students and the art students that we can now invite to our festivals. And we got 10 orbs. Nice. Let's grab this. <laughs> okay, so our orbs are nearly full again, which means we need to go take a nap so we can collect that up. Um, where, where could we put that down? Wow, that took us far away from where we were. Uh, back over here. Uh oh, another cutscene. What are you guys saying now? You're being absolutely preposterous, Dr. Tangent. You're using random words from the dictionary, Dr. Alma. <laughs> Hi. I've cleaned up the island. Indeed, it looks great. The work of a true engineer. That is complete and utter nonsense. Carolee is a dedicated creative at heart. The way you've solved the Philosopher's Stone problem was so elegant. So you can reopen your classes, right? Hmm. Actually, there's one more teeny tiny problem. What problem? The knowledge collection is missing. And there's no way we could rekindle the eternal flame of knowledge without it. Unless... Cut to the chase. You're a knitter. We didn't even have that kind of knowledge before the catastrophe. Wouldn't that be just the most glorious way to rebuild our missing collection? Incredible. I actually agree with you. If you teach our students about knitting, we'll be more than happy to take you in as a student. Okay, I guess I can give a lecture. Splendid. Thanks. Oh boy, now we have to give a lecture? <laughs> what? Give knitting lesson at Bandle University Auditorium. Well, where in the world is that? What is this place? Can we go in here? It doesn't look like it. Okay, um, we, we need to go dream first before uh, our orbs are completely full because we don't want to, you know, we need all the orbs we can get. We got to empty them out so we can fill them back up again. Dream and save. Okay. 
So we have to give a knitting lesson at Bandle University and we're still we're still looking for the post box so we can attach this vending carpet. I just I don't I don't know where to look else. Um, unless I'm really missing it, but the the picture that I saw looked like a tree stump. So we're just kind of checking everything. There wasn't anything over here, was there? Are we allowed to just go in here now? Is this the auditorium? Um, let's see. What's this thing over here? Let's talk to this guy. It's so bright out here. I haven't spent this much time outside in years. Do the outdoors make your hands pruny like being underwater? Achoo! Ugh, nature. I feel that right now. <laughs> Spring is starting to come on and whew, allergies are a real thing. Okay. Can we talk to this upside down guy? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, we have to figure out where the... I'm just going to keep gathering this stuff because we're, we always need more. How full are our pockets right now? Um, and do we ever get more pocket space? Okay, we have a few spaces left in our pockets. We really need to find that post box. Ooh, we have more fireflies. Let's grab those. Have to build them a place in our greenhouse. Let's just go ahead and do that while we're right here. Little things, but it is taking up a pocket space, so we gotta get rid of it. Alright, we already have a hutch ready. No, we already have a hutch ready. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Um, that stuff's already. I'm not gonna mess with that anymore right now, though. Um, how much yarn do we have in our pocket? Just nine. All right, we're not gonna mess with that yet either. Let's pick this back up. And let's see if we can find the Bandle University Auditorium. I thought it might be this building, but it doesn't look like we can go inside there. Um, up there is just the marketplace. Where is the auditorium? Is this it? No. Can you tell us where the auditorium is? <laughs> I will say, I've always loved knitting. There are a few pure artistic forms. Actually, knitting... Oh, yeah, we said this to her before. She's going to pretend we never said that. Okay, where in the world? Can we look at the map, maybe? Whoops. Um, map. Where? Okay, so that is the auditorium right there. It's above the flask to the right. So maybe it is in the square. And actually it looks like there's a, wait, there's a portal we haven't looked at yet? Oh, okay, we can go in the middle here. Interact. Knitting lecture. We need yarn, a butterfly, and five of those rainbow stars. Okay, more crafting. <laughs> That's fine, we got this. Um, nope, we wanted to go this way, this way. Where's that third portal that we haven't opened yet? There's one there and one there. I thought it said there was one more. Okay, we still haven't found Vigar yet either. Okay, so we need to go in here. We need this string. So let's go ahead and put what we have back on there. And then we need to craft one of these butterfly knots. So let's do that. Is that all we needed for the lecture? Oh, we got to get our um, little rainbow stars out of the storage. Oops, we're trying to unroll a mat here. Get in our chest and move the fallen stars over. Okay, what else can we put? Wait, where are these firefly traps coming from? Oh, do we get them back when we pick the fireflies up? We'll move those over to the storage then. And, oh, I hate to put the crystal dust over to storage. 
Let's put the upcycled junk over. I just, I like to keep a few pocket spaces open if we can. All right, let's go give our lecture. I think we have everything we need now. Just gotta go um, to the <laughs> to the right place if we can remember how to get there. Oh, it's down below here. Hello. Here we go. I thought we were learning our way around, but maybe not. <laughs> okay. All right, we have everything we need to give our knitting lecture now, so let's do it. I am thrilled to announce that our university is finally resuming its work. Of course, none of it would be possible without all the hard work of a very special yordle. Me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, thanks, Dr. Sneezewort. Well, I guess Carolee did help a bit. So allow me to present a lecture about magic and culture of knitters from our star yordle. Okay, everyone's watching. I can't back out now. Hi, I'm... Gosh, I'm not that good at public speaking. So, a lecture, right, we're doing it live. <laughs> so, let's talk about knitting. So, knitting may seem hard at first, but the key is, you do it one stitch at a time. Congratulations, you have received Fallen Stars. You can earn Fallen Stars by giving lessons in Bando University, or by completing side quests. Cool. Uh, to customize your backpack, Use indoor building or outdoor building and let your imagination run free. Right, that's what we needed the rainbow stars for. Or what are they called? Fallen stars? To um, do customization inside our little backpack house. Okay, cool. Use the first tab to build different types of home decor. You can spend fallen stars in the second tab to purchase customization sets. The last tab is used to customize your entire house. Wallpaper, bed, windows, and much more. Okay, that'll be fun. Um... So, are we done with our lecture? Oleander has a question. How was the lecture? Well, I always considered studying boring. Wow, did my lecture change that? Nah, turns out doing nothing is even more boring. The lecture was fun, though. I liked how it wasn't specific to the sciences or the arts. Yeah, I'm really tired of that rivalry. Well, maybe it's time to end it for good. How? With a mixer for both departments. Oh, great. <laughs> you mean a party? We should totally have a party right here under the unity tree. Yeah, that's the place where Ozzy had the best ones. That's also where the catastrophe happened. I can fix it. I can fix it. I can save everyone. There's a better place not far from that secret hideout of yours. Let's meet up by the flask. Okay, so we're gonna throw a student mixer, but um, before we do that... Oh, we can give the knitting lecture again. Wow, we can give lots of different lectures. Oh, that one uses those little goggles that we found. We are definitely gonna have to get a blueprint at some point. What in the world is that? There's like a little hand, we got pumpkins, buckets. Oh, there's so much things we haven't found yet. Okay, what if we give another knitting lecture? Can we do that? Oh, there's tabs too. Oh, wow. Look at all these lectures. Oh, we got a long way to go, guys. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Knitting lecture? We can't do it right now, I guess. It's, it's not letting me. Okay, skill required student mixer to throw a student mixer at Bandle Center. So let's check our skill tree. That would not be under knitting or engineering or... Um, well... Where would we find a skill for student mixer? Festivals, student mixer. Okay, so we have to get this one first. And then we can unlock it. Unlock student mixer skill, yes. Okay, unlocked. <laughs> Um, we have 27 left. I'm gonna go ahead and get this big home upgrade. I think. Because we're about to go turn in some more orbs anyway. Alright, let's go put our house down. And, whoops. See what we need to throw a festival. I always go the wrong way. <laughs> I keep thinking, yeah, not great with directions. Okay. Let's put this down. I'm gonna grab a quick nap and replenish our orbs. A 
Okay, and then let's go see about throwing a festival. We still haven't found Vigar, too. I have no idea where to look for him. Okay, which one was the festival tab? This one? Okay. So we have this stuff down already. Um, new friend fest, student mixer. The conditions. Okay, let's see. Have we got all the conditions? No, we don't. Customizations selected, um, but we do want to invite the arts students and we do want to invite, oh, do we not have the, um, the card for the science students yet? Oh, maybe that's what we're missing. Okay, so we can't throw that party yet. Let's see, attach the bending carpet. All right, guys, I think we're gonna have to go back to Yarnville for a minute to find this post box to get our vending carpet. Is there anybody else we need to talk to over here? Not at the moment. All right, we have to figure out how to get the science um, students card for our parties. We can't have a student mixer if we don't have all the students to mix. <laughs> so let's just go back to Yarnville here for a second. Wait, can we use this portal? I can't do anything with this now. Okay, no. So, never mind, JK. Just kidding. Okay, uh, I'm gonna take a minute and look around and see if I can find this post box. And I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, we found it. Um, the elevator is broken, it said. Gee, I wonder where you got that idea from. So I don't know where the elevator was, but normally we can get here. I guess we haven't been to this spot before. You know there's more to life than sarcasm, right? You said sarcastically. <laughs> I guess there's no, to no way to get up until the elevator is fixed. Staying down it is. What elevator are they talking about? I don't know what elevator they're talking about, but we found the post box. <laughs> Let's get our carpet out of here. The vending carpet, nice. Okay, so here's where it was. Uh, we just had to come up from this little shopping area and go past this corner, which I guess I never went over that far before. So let's place, oh, my backpack is already placed somewhere else. See, I gotta get in the habit of picking it up. Let's get down here to where it is then. Oops. This, um, <laughs> Bandle City seems quite a lot bigger than our little Yarnville was. It takes a while to get around. Okay, nope, we went the wrong way again. It's down this hill. Just grab this while we're right here. Okay, so we need to attach our new carpet. A vending carpet. Carpets and pockets. Okay. Congratulations, you've got a vending carpet. Now you can sell items by putting them in a vending machine. Okay. When you add an item to the machine, simply wait until someone buys the item, then you can pick up your stars. Selling goods not only earns stars, but refills the island scores. Cool. By upgrading the vending machine and decorating the carpet, you can improve your sale income modifier. Okay. So... Where did that one show up? Is that this little thing? Nope, that's the Fiesta one. Whoops. Um, let's put that back down. Is it this one? There we go. So what do we want to put in here? Um, we did get this skill, right? Vending machine. Available goods, zero. Let's see... Okay, <laughs> I don't know um, what we can put in there. Can we open this one at the same time? Is there something from our chest that we can put in there? Can we put some parchment in? Let's move that over and see if it lets us do that. Vending machine. Thank you. 
Okay, let's um, just double check our skill tree and make sure that we... Oh no, here we go. Basic merchant. Unlock. Alright, now maybe we can put something in. No? <laughs> okay. Well, that's going to take a little bit of figuring out. Okay, we'll, we'll mess with that in a little bit. But the other thing that we just unlocked, I think... Oh, whoops. Um, was the ability to do some decorating, maybe? To get some home sets? For customizing different things? Let's see, who's Lulu? Have we met someone named Lulu? Timo home set. That looks interesting. All of these cost 10 stars. Oh, let's do the Yumi home set. I just want to do one because we can. <laughs> so let's get um let's get Yumi. And then I think that means maybe we can yes, get a new palette, the Yumi palette. So we're going to go with the purple wall with little paw prints on it. Super cute. Okay, what about the bed? Oh, that is cool. Way fancier. Yeah, let's do that. And then, did it change anything for our Poro? Nope. He still has the same options. We're going to keep him as a little buzzy. Okay, well that's cool. We got to customize our house a little bit. We got a fancy new bed, which we don't need to sleep in right at the moment. What is this? Uh, oh, that's where we can make the blueprint. Okay, let's craft one of those because we need that for some of our other things. Good to know. I didn't realize we had another kind of workbench up here. So we are going to need to make some more ink, I guess, at some point. And I don't remember <laughs> which bench we needed to that, uh, do that, but um, that gives us the ability to build an assembly bench. Oh, it's raining now. Let's just take a look here. Uh, what else we can add? A confetti cannon. Very interesting. We can build a dance floor. Is that something we can add to our festival? That would be super fun. Okay, but we're not trying to build a dance floor on this carpet. Ooh, junk upcycler 2. I wonder what that does. Let's get one of those. Where can we fit it? We'll fit it... How about right on this spot? I don't know what those little magnifying glasses do, but we're going to find out. Let's see what this Junk Upcycler 2 does. Use. Ah, now we can make iron. Nice. Let's make some of that. Let's make, um, we'll just go ahead and do 10. Nice. So now we'll be able to craft some of the other things. Okay. But I think we're actually going to leave it right there for today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. When we pick up next time, we'll still be looking for Vigar, and we're going to work on throwing a festival, the student mixer, at the Bandle Center. Uh, we still have quite a few preparations to make for that, so it's going to take a little bit of time. But I appreciate you so much for being here with me today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please take a moment to click the like button and maybe leave me a comment. Let me know if you have any tips for me or if there's anything I can help you with. And if you're enjoying this playthrough and you like other cozy games as well, be sure to click subscribe so you can join us for the next one. I'll see you there, friends. Have a beautiful day.